Good morning, class. Good morning. You guys are pretty down today. Good morning, class. Good morning. Good morning. Okay, yeah, I like that. Well, my name is Julio. You can call me Mr. B. I'll be your new instructor for the remainder of the summer. I'll teach you guys um, math. You guys will be with me for a long time. So I want to get to know each and every one of you guys. We'll be doing a nice break at first. I'll throw the ball to one of you guys, and I want you guys to stand up, state your name, and say you guys and say what you guys want to be when you guys grow up. Are you guys ready? Yes. You guys sure? Yes. Ready? Yes. There you go. My name is Sam. I want to be a scientist. Good job. My name is Country. I want to be a I like that. Pretty good. Well, I'm going to say a little bit about myself. I'm from New York City. I moved down here three years ago. I'm a rising senior. I'm at Andrew Central Senior High School. I will be um, soon going to college and I will major in international affairs. Some of you guys know, may not know that, but you guys um, will know at the end of the summer. Well, I'll do something real quick. When I say work hard, I want you guys to say get smart. Work hard, get smart. Work hard, get smart. Work hard, get smart. Work hard, get smart. Good job, guys. Good job. Well, today lesson will consist of solving two sets of equations. And you guys know how to do that? No. You guys never seen this before? No. Well, today you guys will know. Um, it takes two steps to solve an equation of equality that has more than one operation. Here you guys see two math problems. I want you guys to take 10 seconds and write both of these comments on a sheet of paper. Right hand you guys are done. Good job. First, I'll do the first one by myself so you guys have an idea how you do it. The second one we'll do it together. So please keep your eyes open, guys. Four plus four, which is minus four, both sides. Since we want to isolate the s by itself, four crosses out. Total so minus four is eight. You bring the rest down, which is two x. So we want to isolate the x. So here, since two is multiplying x, we need to do the inverse of multiplication, which is inverse. So we divide by two, both sides. The two cancels out. We bring the s down. A divided by 2 is 4. Now, I recommend for you guys to check your answers by plugging the value of x back into the equation. Wherever you see x, you guys will plug 4. value of s is correct, which is s equals 4. Now, this problem we'll do it together. I want you guys to speak up and stay in, in, into the conversation. Mm -hmm. um, what is the inverse of um, subtracting? Well, great job, guys. We had 2 on both sides. 10 plus 2? 12. 12. Great job. We bring the rest down and cancel out. Elijah, the inverse of multiplication here? Division. So we divide four where? Both sides. Great job. The four cancels out, we bring X. Sammy, 12 divided by four? Three. Good job, Sam. Now, we need to plug it back in. So wherever we see X, we plug it back into the equation. S equals 3. Four times 3, control. 12. Good job. Total minus 2, Sammy? 10. 10. Which means 10 equals 10, so we got the correct value of X. Great. I want you guys to take this home, study, 
I'll give you, I'll sign you guys some homework, and I want to see you guys next week. And I hope you guys have a, good, a wonderful day. Clap it up, guys. Clap it up. See you guys.